Pluto is a planet again. Oh no. Pluto, you won't believe it. Please don't tell me this is gonna be sad. How are you all here? Turns out the Earthlings changed their mind on their definition of what a planet is. Wait. Size doesn't matter anymore. Why are there for planets? Voice is oh, so cute. Boy. <laughs> is this really happening? A am I a planet again? <laughs> yeah. Why well, got a southern accent? Wrong. You're a star to me. Star? <laughs> Oh, don't Mercury. You mean planet? No. <laughs> I don't. Oh no. I deserve this. <laughs> Good job. We were sick of him. We have a new star Mars? now. Well, star? But, but please you tell me they keep their accents. Pluto. Saturn Pluto. has an Australian Pluto. accent. Pluto. Pluto. Oh, oh. Don't tell me this is a dream. Hey, oh, it's just it, a dream. Pipsqueak. You're looking like a real Pluto right now. Oh, oh. yeah. <laughs> Why does Earth kind of oh, sound stop like being such a Pluto, Mercury? For a second, he sounded uh, like Morty planets. from Rick and Morty. Oh, he was just dreaming. I've literally been begging for this channel for like a full year, Planet Ball channel. Except this is called Solar Balls. Go sub to him. It's so funny because one of the top videos I've ever made on this channel is actually a Planet Ball video. This Planet Ball video is bigger than all my Country Ball videos. Hey guys, what if planets guys. collide? Wait, 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 wait. What the heck is that? Taiwan. Dude. Wanna merge together and make new planets? Ew. I don't want to know your oh, that, weird fantasy. Yeah, that is it means that you almost oh. crashed into him. Are we gonna get some weird planet you, fan fiction? A few years, new planets I've formed. explored planet <laughs> humans enough. I don't want to do that. Oh, so let me get this straight. If I crash against one of you, it's almost like when my earthlings make babies. Dude, what is not the Whoa, you, whoa. Weirdo? That I is say it's more like a phoenix. That's you how the moon was created. New life will blossom out of your ashes. Yeah, nice metaphor, Venus. You're quite a poet. Shut up. <laughs> this all sounds it's like too weird. A northeastern you have accent. Proof that two planets have collided in the past to form new planets. I feel like Venus well, should be a girl. Uh, sorry to blow your inner core, but <laughs> where do you think you and the moon came from? Yeah, the moon. This is what I'm saying. <laughs> So many references to that. I've read so many comics about how like the moon is kind of like our baby because two planets collided and then it created. Yeah, let's not get into it. Hey, uh, what if the sun disappeared? Okay, first of all, I just want to say I feel like Earth and Mars should be kind of best friends. But kind of like a friendly rivalry in a way. If the sun just, uh, you know, disappears. The sun just well, disappears. I don't know. I mean, it would... Wait, does the moon talk? Dark. Okay, yeah, you think my only purpose is to be a, a, a giant space light bulb? <laughs> you heard you just, just take it, but you're getting this message from eight minutes oh. in the past because of how light travels and relativity or whatever? Yes. In reality, I'm already gone. Oh, man, this and is so good. Soon, you'll see what really happens if I'm gone. Is he gonna go supernova? Mr. Sun, he is, he is very sorry. No, I'm not. Let him leave. Let's see what happens. You idiot! Oh. You know why they call it the solar system? Now we're gonna be a bunch of frozen Plutos drifting yep. through space. Yep. Dead planets. We need the sun's gravitational pull to stay in orbit. Oh, I love how educational this is. I'll try to keep us together with my own gravity. But Jupiter could, but I don't know if it'll be enough. Yeah, I don't think they're big enough. I don't think it's big enough. Gonna be the death of us all. Not your own stupidity. Okay, okay, I'm sorry, son. All right, just don't. Son, what? <laughs> He's got an anger problem. I was bluffing. I'm not going anywhere, guys. <laughs> All stay together forever. I think uh, he might be kind of a crazy. So a red giant and consume you all. Yes. <laughs> uh, he, he's kidding, right? I want to see that. I love how Mercury just has to be silent, like right next to this complete psycho. It makes sense that the sun would kind of be like a lunatic with his like crazy solar flares. He just kind of goes into rage mode sometimes. What if the moon now went hey away? Hey there, oh, little guy. All my poor you came from Earth, right? surfers. Oh, God, okay. No waves. Keep yourself together. <sighs> Astronauts, uh, come. Uh, yeah, I'm from Earth. Cool. Me too. Though, he <laughs> really makes me feel like I don't matter sometimes. Oh. I guess we do focus a lot on Mars. Is that what he's saying? Maybe he doesn't know how important you are. What was that? You know what? Is this him watching just random asteroids collide? Maybe he doesn't know how important you are? I think you know I agree what? with that. I, I think you're right. Yeah. I should go and orbit another planet to show him. Uh -oh. Hey, thanks, Earthling. You hear that, Earth? I'm leaving. Wait, did I just end the world? I love... Um, hey, Earth's maybe. moon. Hey, Mars. Can I orbit you for now? Huh. He already has a buddy. Well, Earth doesn't mind. Trust me. He doesn't. Mars is going right, to adopt then. our sun? Go over there where Phobos and Deimos are orbiting. Yeah. Mars already has... Aren't you asteroids? No! <laughs> I'm Phobos! And I'm Deimos! 
They're just super Does annoying. Must be like you. <laughs> uh, sure. How? Maybe you can crash into Mars. Yeah, there's... And we can use the space debris to grow bigger. Yeah, I was gonna say they're yes, still really young bigger! moons, so it makes sense that they're like they're toddler <laughs> moons. Very annoying. Okay, the moons of Mars are freaking weird. Yeah. Oh. Yes, you can say that again. Moon, where the heck were you? I'm oh. off my axis, and my tides are all out of whack. Oh, Get back in off orbit axis. Now. I guess he learned his lesson, huh? Huh? Yeah, so this astronaut did almost destroy all of humanity. Thanks, Neil Armstrong. I feel like this is such a good video to do right after the James Webb Telescope. Everyone has a new fascination with this whole galaxy. I kind of want to see more adventures of our moon going and visiting all the other moons, all the crazy moons on like Jupiter and Saturn. Can you imagine that? There's actually a lot of room for a lot of characters in the whole planet ball universe. Look how many moons the gas giants have. I always forget there's just so much to talk about besides just the main characters here. Hey! I'm still hey taken back by Venus's voice. Planets, right? well, I, I Why is there well, only life on hey, Earth? Sun doesn't like it when we're out of our orbit. Uh -oh. Yeah, that's neat. Anyways, the reason the Earth has yeah, I'm life so glad is in the Goldilocks. The voices Goldie, stay with the planets. Oh, I know about that. It's a very specific area in a star's orbit where a planet is not too hot for uh, yes. water to evaporate. The the life is it zone. Too cold for it to freeze. Why does it matter where they are in the orbit? Want to answer that, Mercury? Oh, have you yeah, noticed how freaking hot we are? <laughs> how cold Uranus is? <laughs> oh, we we had. Sorry. Yes, I've noticed. We had to include so that. So tell me, what's the difference between us? There had to be and a Uranus, Uranus joke. <laughs> is this gonna be the video where we just? Sorry. We do all the What's jokes. So funny? All yeah, the Uranus I, jokes. I don't get the butt of the joke. <laughs> <laughs> You're killing me here. <laughs> Just tell me the freaking difference between me and Uranus. We're closer to the sun, thus we're hotter. Oh. Mm. So, Come on, Venus. position yourself it's at not just that the right distance from the sun, you'll have a better chance of developing life, like the Earth has. Hey, Earthlings, stop nuking each other. Hey, no, bad. Uh, stop, stop it. Yeah, maybe life, you don't, here for now. yeah, you don't Thanks. want it. I like that we've been focusing a lot on the inner four planets. What is going on with those gas giants? My best friend, hey, the hey, sun. Mercury. You know why I never went to college? Uh, I don't know. Because I already have a million degrees. Uh. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, he is a little crazy. Oh, oh, I see. You want to hang out with them? He wants his other friends. You got me. Nobody else is as close to me as you are. Well, and that's true. 35 million miles is not my definition of close, but sure, I'm the closest planet to you. Closest I bestie. That. I mean, I mean, we're friends. Oh. Best friends. Or maybe, maybe I'm wrong. And hey, no. We, we oh are no. Friends. Sure. Am I actually I, gonna I feel mean, bad for the sun? Pretty cool. Actually, I'm pretty hot. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, goodness. another sun pun. Oh, oh, wait. <laughs> He's got to deal with that for like kinda, it's, all of the solar system. It's, it's corona. Wait, wait, what? isn't that an earthling yeah. disease? What? No, coronal mass ejection. Oh, wait, oh. are you having a solar flare? Oh, no. Oh, Mercury would be the first to go once the sun finally loses it. This channel's so good. Why do we want to live on Mars? Well, I guess we're going to get the answers to that. We are on Mars. Ouch! Oh. What's up with your Earthlings' obsession with making me the second wish, home? I wish Earth uh, sneezed on can him. Can we not talk about it? Dude, you never want to talk about this. All right, man. Uh -oh. You really want to This is actually going to be depressing. My Earthlings want to colonize him. you. What's that supposed because, to mean? Some oh. of them think Mars could be their future. I mean, we're kind of similar. Gravity, water in some form, mm, an water. atmosphere. Even if they can't breathe your air. Mars had... Huh. No I water. guess I get that. They can be a bit annoying, but if I really am the best option they have, uh, if by you far, were their best option, Astro Dude over here wouldn't need a closed off environment to be on your surface. Oh. Your temperature is deadly, your air is poison, and you're not hospitable to plants or animals. They've been talking about terraforming you, but yeah, yeah that's not going to happen anytime soon. That's going to be torture for Why Mars, don't they right? stay on you then? <sighs> Guess dreaming about you is easier than dealing with what they're doing to me. Oh no, this is what I was talking about. Jeez, uh, man, I'm sorry. Like how got deep. The moon's um, still playing you cards. Wanna keep playing cards? Yeah, let's just not talk about it. That's actually really depressing. Like secretly, the Earth is really sad on the inside because we're just slowly destroying them. Am I watching these videos out of order? There might be like an actual order I have to be watching them in. So space is normal, they said. Back? Oh, honey, it's a mission. Oh, so here's no the astronaut. Update. 
I'm going to be discovering the secrets of the solar system and beyond. I want to know where they're from. This has always been my dream. Just they're just come back white you hear me. balls. I will. Is this promise a former French back. empire that just had a white flag? Is hey, it okay? Uh, they're American. Astro dude. United States of America. Uh, oh, uh, it, it's okay. an honor. Same. Uh, hey, be oh, sure to here bring we go. back some of that space oil, okay? A NASA ball. Uh, oh, are they gonna start a oil in space? So a corporate the ball Work channel like one time? One day? Okay, five, four, three, two, one. Wait, 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 wait. Ever since Just corporations involved, as balls. Being an astronaut. Years of training and sacrifice, all for this moment. When everyone always talks about this is epic looking at the earth from the heavens they say your perspective on life changes oh this is gonna be space. terrifying huh if that's true then hello you... little guy hello. welcome to space hey earth tell your earthlings to stop trying to propagate around the solar system like friggin lice oh oh i want to see hello astro dude <laughs> Yeah, that's terrifying. Why am I... So I'm imagining planet balls saying, hey, whoa, what planet ball out there would be like equivalent to a furry? I've actually been sitting here for like two minutes trying to think. First, we had the sun missing, then the moon missing. Now, Venus is missing. Ah, ouch. Okay, uh, t time out, dude. What was that? <laughs> oh. Okay. Wait. Are they still... quiet. Yeah. Are they still... Why isn't Venus telling us we're acting like reckless idiots? Oh, yeah, Is I know. Venus actually gone? Have uh -oh. you guys never noticed that before? He's on orbit behind the sun, like, every year and a half. Oh. I like how Jupiter while, sounds like a dad. While he isn't Jupiter's here, our dad uh, that protects us from asteroids. Well, Venus never lets me come close to y'all. Man, you can't let Venus control your life. You gotta stand up for yourself. Yeah. What's his problem, anyways? It's always, your Earthlings did this, and your Earthlings did that. Well, exactly. Whoa. He's just a, a, a mean, hot rock. Yeah, With he's... metal rain and, and heat and... And your Earthlings wouldn't even want to visit him. He's pretty volatile. Or on him. Oh, he's and, jealous too. And he keeps insulting me just because I'm small. It calls me Pipsqueak. Oh, he's coming back. Ah, he's coming he's back a around. Trash <laughs> planet. Well, why would I care wh oh. what he uh, thinks about? Get back to your orbit, Pipsqueak. <laughs> yes, Mr. Venus, sir. Hey. Are you playing asteroid dodgeball again, you reckless idiots? There's uh, so there much, it is. so much lore to explore here. Benevolent Big Brother is also a good way to describe Jupiter. At the same time, I have read comics that describe Jupiter is kind of creepy because their gravitational pull is is so large they steal moons away from other planets, like some sort of weird abduction. I'm just gonna choose to completely forget that and continue to think that they're like our dad. Hey, Earth. Can we survive on Mars? Doing some weird stuff on my surface. How is like that this my is problem? an ongoing storyline. Oh, come on, dude. So are they? Are All we terraforming right, him already? The Earth at such yeah. Alarming speed. Kind I of. I think we should move forward with our find another home project. Sounds good, sir. I'm awaiting my orders. Is this Matt Damon? Cool. cool. Okay. I need you to get out there and you know, see how long you can survive on Mars without a suit. Oh. Uh, studies say I'd pass out in 30 seconds, and oh. then I'd die in a minute or so. Also, it's like Not minus bad. 60 degrees Celsius, and there's no oxygen. Yeah, yeah, but scientists based on experiments, not studies. True. I think. How do you Never think we figured out, we like, try. what mushrooms right? we could eat and oh, which ones we couldn't? Hey, we just had to have someone so go out there so and good. experiment you see, it. You're alive and well. Hey, guys, look. We're making history today. Maybe Mars is habitable. Uh, sir, he's already passed out of uh -oh. hypothermia and is about to die. <laughs> I'm gonna call my lawyer. Someone's gotta be a guinea pig to do it. Hey, give me a free ride. May maybe I'll think about it. The secrets hey, uh, of Earth's Venus. Moon? Come here one sec. Why in the universe is Venus, uh, you know, playing made to Earth? Yeah, oh. that. Well, oh, they're sister I planets. I hear the conversation right? it since it happened like during the day, but I heard something about Venus's name and true meaning, and that's embarrassing oh, oh, enough oh, oh, for oh, oh. Venus to play Earth's servant? Yeah, I think Earth is blackmailing Venus to keep the secret. Oh, now I really want to know, but I guess neither of them will tell us. Hmm. Hello, Astro. Oh, the, uh, the asteroid dude. Hey, so you being such a scholar of space stuff, do you know what Venus's name means? So this guy's gonna be a character here too. Is, is this like a a, a threat? No. Yes. Wait, what? <laughs> you are named after the Roman goddess of love and beauty. What? <laughs> <laughs> so we finally but, addressed hey, it. It wasn't me. 
Astro well, at least you don't have to be like, you know, waiting on Earth hand and feet anymore. That's why I thought Venus would have a lady voice. So it makes it actually funnier that he doesn't. Venus wants a makeover. It's ironic, though, right? I mean, you, a giant ball of acid rain and volcanoes being named after Venus, the Roman goddess of beauty? Yeah. I mean, that's it, you little... <laughs> Okay, I'm I mean, sick of this. He I'm looks beautiful to you guys on the outside, good enough. but oh, on the inside, on, I, didn't mean I don't it like know. That. Aww. What kind of makeover can Venus get? Maybe Venus can get terraformed. Oh, he's leaving? Hey, Uranus, the other planets won't leave me alone about this Finally, thing. the gas you know planets. To shut them up. Pfft. Rings, of course. Every pretty planet has true, rings. True, true. Well, that sucks. They're made of, like, gravity-crushed space debris, right? I'm not strong enough for that. Maybe I could ask Saturn for one. Hey! There's I a whole asteroid built. You know. Hello! <laughs> hey, Saturn! <laughs> Everyone forgets about and, uh, Uranus's rings. I would like to borrow a ring, please. Oh. You want to improve your looks a little, goddess of beauty? <laughs> yes, please. Well, if you ask so nicely. Can you give him a ring? Oh. What? Is that bad? Ah, stop okay. It, you idiot. That was like a SpongeBob so moment when things got hey, really detailed. Goddess of love, you're pretty harsh. Not very beautiful behavior, my lady. <laughs> 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 you got a problem with the earthlings naming me after some stupid ancient goddess? Well, keep that does suck from, make over. from Venus's perspective. You got yeah, named after I thought so. Earth is earthlings, earth, earth li life. Like, that, what does it have to do with you? You're Venus, and you got Earth out here naming you. I can see why they're angry. Once again, please go subscribe to Solar Balls. I haven't actually been able to check out this channel until now. I am really impressed. I can see it one day even rivaling Mr. Spherical. And big thanks to my patrons. Isaac, I guess. Australia's Susius Chungus. Ashton Powers Faja. A Suso's man. A fat My name Norwal. is Joe Biden. I love fat being Joe nuts. Biden. Drew's Argentinian grandpa. Cowboys 83. Bring back Polar Born Ball. Ski w. Good old Raya. I stole Drew's pet dog. Jakov, Bruni, Marco, Hendetta, 5610, Fresh animation. Rise, the Mexican Why am I doing this? The 